uploads and upload them to YouTube. So if the if the yeah, the guys from the other team want to see it, just oh okay. So I have to, so I have to load. My, I'll add that. I'm gonna need help walking through that. Is there any way to cut it off? Do I just, can I stop the stream and start the stream? One oh, you mean you want to like take the VOD and just cut, cut it? it, just cut it, it yeah, you can. Yeah, you just go to um, upload and it's gonna put like uh, um, a cutting option or something. That'll, I'll have to mess with that when we, get, when we get done. Yeah. Alrighty, it's gonna be a PVZ on merry-go-round. I really like this map. It's good for blink stalkers. Uh, like yeah. you, you can just blink in the main. So easy. It's not bad for blink stalkers, but there's a lot of area for Zerg to run into your ramp. That's gonna be the hardest part. Luckily, yeah. Stripes is gonna be a more aggressive player, so he's gonna push probably. But he's playing on his mom's laptop, so this is gonna be interesting. <laughs> yeah. But against Zerg, the wall for this, I had to look it up because it is extremely difficult. But in the uh, top left corner position from Team Para Op, we have our blue Zerg player, Trinity. And in the top right hand corner from Team Team Elite, we have the green Protoss player, Stripes. Oh my god. These guys are having an interesting conversation. You are allowed to talk. Yeah, okay, sorry. Sure. It's just my mom was talking to me for a second. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm sitting here like, uh, I'm all myself. Yay. <laughs> no, don't worry. Um, okay, so it's gonna, gonna, is Trump's gonna go for a Forge Fast Expand? No, it's gonna be a gateway first expo. Um, okay. It's gonna be a 13 gateway at the ramp. It, it'll just it prevent. It's one way to prevent six pools. I prefer to go next to my gas. It's easier to keep things alive, in my opinion. But uh, this is definitely a very common thing. But the only bad part is right here. If you look, there's a big gap that one zealot can't actually. Yeah. When I when I played Protoss, I used to have a lot of trouble uh, with the walls and uh, Zerg in general because of that. Yeah, this map, like I said, this map is a little trickier to actually wall off of the main. So it's going to be a 13 gas, or 15 gas, my bad, 13 gateway, 15 double gas, okay. It's getting a little greedy. Uh, double gas, it depends, if you go 3 and 3 each, it'll be a text-based build, so it could be DT's uh, Stargate play, something like that. Um, still, But Zerg is going hatch first. He went hatch first, he still has no... Spawning pool, is he going? Oh, there's a spawning pool, okay. Yeah. I thought he was about to go like three hatch for pool, and this map is not a good choice. So, that would have been quite interesting. Um, weird build, he's, there's still no cyber core coming out. Yeah. He's the latest cybernetic score. For the gateway, oh, Zerg is delaying his expo um, for your stripes. A little bit, yeah. He's just now get, he's now getting the 400 minerals. Uh, stripes should have kept that other probe down there. The only thing that's really really bad right now is he's mining gas and has no way to spend it. That yeah. that, that was the that was the biggest thing. Like, that he he, he he didn't make a decision. And but he's going for four gates before the cybernetic score. No, oh, it's no three gates he, cyber yeah, core he in there. Yeah. He's probably gonna four gate though. And here yeah, comes probably. the here comes the drone. He should have killed the drone, and he's gonna always oh, he scouted both of it. <laughs> Stripes is all sorts of lost right now. He has no idea what he's about to do. Uh, he better drop his nexus, which is dropping right now. Uh, should get a mothership core as quickly as possible. And there's that mothership and, yeah, core. There's the mothership core. And Trinity's still mining gas. Uh, that's cool. Actually, no, they need that to get the layer. It'll be interesting. Yeah. It'll be interesting to see what he goes though. If he's gonna go more 
Speed, speed League Hydra on this map is actually pretty good. There's a lot of open spaces with a few choke points to get caught, caught in, but for the most part, you can wrap your Hydras around and just do massive mass damage. Easy oh, but Strife is going for a 3 great Robo. I don't think Strife knows what he's doing at this point. I think he's just like YOLO. I think he YOLO'd. I think that's exactly yeah, what happened. Or he's just expecting uh, roaches and wants to make immortals. Here comes this Zergling push. It's still 40 seconds off, 30 seconds off from getting speed, so it's gonna. He needs to wait. That's not. Yeah. It's a little too soon still. Because he could easily lose these. That one century could stop this. And. Oh, he There's didn't. There's a hole. Oh, he didn't, he didn't pay attention, and now. There are Zerglings that you're about to have speed in, oh, and now they have speed, and this is not good. This might, this is going to do massive amounts of damage, and could honestly be a GG situation. There's no warp gate. Yeah. Oh, there's the, there's the photon overcharge, so it kills off a lot of Zerglings in the main, but there's still Yeah, but his natural is in. still and really... That natural is going to go down. He needs to just focus fire the Nexus and go about his business, because that Mothership Core doesn't do enough DPS. So somehow this mothership core is protecting this. Yeah, this and now there's roaches coming, so it's gonna be even worse. Yeah, I don't see how he can win this. There's no immortals coming out. He's supply blocked heavily. Down 20 supply, and now there's speed leads in the base. There's only a couple stalkers and a mothership core. There's not enough DPS to deal with this, and there goes another stalker. Yeah, I think that is GG. This is gonna be a GG. Now that he's gonna see the roaches coming, and he Good. Yeah, there's just not. Yeah. And there goes the corpse. Yep, yeah, it's 19 workers of 22. He could drone on the back of this and be just fine. To be honest, he needs to drone on the back of this. He needs to get drop another hatch somewhere. They take his third, drop a macro, and just build on his lead. Because if he doesn't win with this, which he should, but there is always the possibility he doesn't. That. Yeah. But looks like uh, Stripes is holding it, but there's so much more units coming in. He needs to force seal that hole. Can... There we go. He needs to warp in some more sentries and get them immortals out because that one yeah. sentry is not going to be able to hold that forever. Well, th there's two immortals um, coming, so if he holds this uh, this push, I think he could still he still has a chance. I think. Oh no. Or not. There, there's no, no way to hold it. this. <laughs> There's no gas yeah, being mined at all. So all, all he can, all he can really do is warp in zealots, and he only has two active warp gates against a bazillion zerglings, and the zerglings are just DPS down that immortal. Uh, he's holding yeah, on pretty well. You. Don't want to count him out yet, but like, yeah, there's there comes the GD from Stripes, yeah. and Para Optics takes game one. Pretty aggressive. Uh, Stripes just made some bad decisions. Couldn't figure out what he wanted to do. If he wanted to go macro or tech, and once you go gateway first, you got you kind of don't have a choice. You have to tech at the same time. Did I do okay? Yeah. In the casting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was a little nervous at the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be okay. I think JJ's up next. It's it's gonna be um, Trinity versus JJ. Yes. Okay. Which could put us in a hole. I really like TVZ. It's fun. Do you There's a lot of. Huh? You, for the aggressive type, or do you want to play macro? Oh, I really like the aggressive type, like dropping, um, circling her, like all the harass. I just.